Hello everyone, Juicebags here, and wanted to take a moment to say thank you to everyone that subscribed or watches the channel, and to say Happy New Year. Uh, 2013, the channel has really grown, come a long way, hit uh, that thousand subscriber mark, which I never thought we would do, and uh, 2014, hopefully we can double or triple that, would be ideal. Yeah, I did a lot of Orcs Must Die 2, a lot of Minecraft, uh, a lot of miscellaneous stuff in 2013. Uh, 2014 has got uh, a, what could be a lot of interesting games coming out. Now, uh, as always, hopefully there's something else from Robot Entertainment. Uh, they did just release Echo Prime uh, just a, a couple of months ago. I'm anxious to see that come out on the Android device and uh, not just for iOS. And hopefully by that time I will have a uh, tablet that I can play on. Right now, I uh, I don't do much mobile style gaming. I uh, I have a Galaxy S4, and I'm I'm kind of a spoiled PC gamer though, to be honest with you. I can't uh, I I don't really play games very often on that little screen unless I have good reason to. Um, waiting for the wife, whatever whatever that reason may be. Um, besides um, wanting to get into some of the mobile tablet pocket edition style games. Uh, in 2014, we've got a expansion for World of Warcraft, Warlords of Draenor. I'll definitely be playing that. To what extent, I don't know. I'll at least be going through the story and uh, checking out the uh, new PvP season. I'll get involved with that a little bit. However, I'm not going to grind it for months on end like I used to. As I want to, I want to just have fun. Um, I don't like playing games just to play games. I'm not going to make videos just to make videos. If I'm not having fun doing it, um, I'm probably not going to do it. Um, hopefully, 2014 will also bring some upgrades to uh, my equipment. Uh, could use a little bit, uh, uh, some sound upgrades. As far as the my machine itself, it's pretty solid. Uh, I don't really plan on doing much with it in 2014, but um, I'd like to get a new mic set up. Uh, possibly, depending on, you know, the wife likes to come in and watch TV a lot of times while I'm recording and um, you know that can cause some some conflicts with the sound of course I better run in here and get healed up a little bit I'm just gabbing away uh, a couple of the games that are out that are in like an early release uh, not even necessarily beta build yet that look interesting is um, you know DayZ of course that had a, a big following as a mod and uh, that is available as a standalone game now that's, you know, just early release, of course. Still uh, very buggy and lots of things to fix. So, um, it definitely looks like it has potential. Uh, for some reason, I've been um, kind of drawn to that Project Zomboid game a little bit. I just am kind of interested in playing that. And then I'd love to get a little another Minecraft series started. However, I just don't know what mod pack to use. As everyone knows, I love the technology. Uh, Tekkit was by all means my favorite. However, Tekkit, Tekkit is in serious need of an upgrade uh, to 1.6.4 or later. Uh, the Technic Launcher, of course, handles 1.6.4 now. So I'm kind of surprised to um, see that there hasn't been an updated version of Tekkit put out. Now, there are some uh, um, techie type mod packs that are out that have just about all of the tech and stuff in the mix that are updated to 1.6.4. Uh, we have Lapido's Galacticraft, which is uh, recently updated to 1.6.4. And then also Rage Tech, which Rage, Rage Tech has just a ton of mods. Uh, a lot of stuff involved there. Um, it's tech it plus some, to be honest with you. Uh, what else uh, do we have? The Lapidos, I think, is the most interesting to me. However, I, I'll definitely have to add a few more of my favorite mods in, you know, into the mix to make it a little bit more juice friendly. Um, of course, there's going to be um, more orc killing involved. You know, maybe we'll all get lucky and there will be an OMD three at some point. Hopefully, that's uh, something on the drawing board for Robot. Um, if not, I'm sure they will release something cool. Uh, what other games are in the mix? There is uh, Defense Grid 2. 
hopefully is going to be releasing in 2014. They are fully funded and developing, so um, not quite to a beta stage or anything yet, but um, 2014 should bring Defense Grid 2, and that's that's pretty much the best straight-up tower defense game ever made, really. Um, as far as the FPS uh, tower defense games, we got, you know, the Orcs Must Die, of course, and then also Dungeon Defenders, which was was a little bit grindy, but was super, super fun. Uh, Dungeon Defenders 2 is is um, in uh, early alpha stage as well. Uh, hopefully it's going to be released in 2014. Um, it's fully funded also, so there shouldn't be any issues with uh, getting it out the door. The, but the main purpose of this video was just to say thank you to everyone and Happy New Year, and then also get any suggestions anyone might have. If there's any games that you would like to see, or uh, games that I've played in the past that you would like to see more of, by all means, post it in the comments below. Um, I'll do everything I can to, to get to all the games people want to see. Um, if it's a game that's fun to me, you can count on seeing quite a bit of it. Um, if it's, you know, if you just want to review on a game that uh, is free or inexpensive, um, I love doing that. I love checking out new stuff. And, um, of course, I'm always going to give you an honest opinion. Um, if I think the game sucks, I'm going to tell you I think it sucks. So hopefully save everyone some, some time and money there. But uh, as far as right immediately, uh, like I said, that Project Zomboid and DayZ are both available right now for, under early access. And I'm, I've been seriously considering those. And then also, I, I just have really been jonesing to play another, uh, to, to get another Minecraft series started. And still, I'm just at the point where I don't know which mod pack to play. If I was to start one today, it would either be Rage Tech or a modified version of the Lapidos Galacticraft. Uh, what my, I know we've, I've got a lot of um, viewers and subscribers to the channel that uh, like the Minecraft videos. So what mod pack would you like to see if I was to uh, start another Minecraft series? I'm also not uh, completely against doing just an adventure maps. I'm not uh, I'm not big into the Minecraft PvP. As if I'm going to PvP, I would I would probably play other games. The Minecraft PvP, after PvPing in so many games, is a little bit bland to me, to be honest with you. However, I love the building. I love the discovering new things and figuring out how all the uh, the random techie mods work and how to incorporate them into uh, you know to a fun little little series so by all means post your comments below give me some suggestions what would you like to see what uh, would you like to see more of and most importantly everyone have a happy new year so thanks again